Okay, boys and girls, today we're going to be talking about this modification setup for the Desert Eagle. Now, as the Desert Eagle continues to progress in testing, I definitely want to run it more as an outdoors pistol and as a pistol overall for wilderness defense. But this chest rig, but how I've chosen to run it is a chest rig. Now, if you guys know, I definitely love running a lot of neck knives and neck knives and chest rigs kind of uh, don't quite fit together. They don't play nice, I guess you could say. And so I thought or got to work on devising a system that I think is actually pretty cool, pretty nifty, not to uh, toot my horn too much or think that I'm amazing, but I divided her devised a strategy of being able to have a really solid general purpose camp knife attached to my chest rig and this is what I came up with and today we're going to be going over what the knife is and why I set it up this way. So let's first talk about the setup. Of course this is a Desert Eagle in 50 AE and the holster itself is a Gunfighter Inc. or Gunfighters Incorporated Kenai holster. These are actually very popular here in Alaska for many different revolvers and even other pistols. And that's kind of where it got its name for Kenai, of course, being a place in Alaska where a lot of fishing is done. So this is a chest rig holster that I had custom made for the Desert Eagle because there are not that many Desert Eagle chest rig holsters out there. In fact, there's really not that many holsters for Desert Eagles in general. So this one was custom made for this Mark 19 and it fits really great. Love the system but like I said when I was devising the idea of a chest rig I realized that it would get in the way of a neck knife. So that is where I began to think what would be an epic knife to attach to this rig because there are all these different holes on the system so I definitely knew that I could rig some kind of blade to this uh, to this system and of course I wanted to have a kydex sheath knife. One of my favorite kydex sheath knives that I have is the Three Dog Knives or 3DK MAK or Multi Animal Knife and I also found or I also thought it'd be pretty fitting because this is an Alaskan made knife. This is an Alaskan themed uh, chest rig that I would want to keep it all kind of with the Alaskan setup. So this is, like I said, a 3DK MAK, and it is just a really awesome general purpose knife, whether you're hunting and skinning with this guy, or you're actually using it for general bushcrafting, camp crafting tasks. And so overall, that is the choice for the blade, uh, for the knife. This one, of course, is made in K110, and uh, it obviously has tan g10 handles and actually i have to say i think that the kydex pairing is pretty nice you have a good deal of tan and then you have this nice splash of green and of course you have the tan in the g10 you also have just a little touch of color with the red back there and the orange down here but those are just kind of touches to make everything kind of pop and so overall this is the knife. Uh, like I said, the MAK is a fantastic blade for general purpose woods tasks. So I did have to do some kind of finagling to get this alignment to work out. It wasn't my favorite bolts. So this is a little bit of a work in progress. It may change, especially this one down here, because as you guys can see here, this, uh, this one moves a little bit due to the fact that this bolt is on this kind of swivel here. So it has, hasn't necessarily wiggled loose yet. These are both pretty tight and there's a few uh, rubber washers on this one to help it stay put. But overall, it's a work in progress, but it does work pretty well. And the nicest part about it is the fact that you can, with good ease, draw the knife out and do whatever cutting tasks you need, resheath the knife just like that, and still have the pistol completely accessible, completely out of the way, or this knife is completely out of the way, you know, the pistol is fully accessible, and you can draw the handgun one-handed if you need it for whatever tasks or purposes might come up, and then like I said, if you need your knife to uh, do something, you can certainly have ready access to it. Overall, it's not the best solution or maybe the most perfect solution, but it's a pretty darn good solution if you are going to be running a chest rig to have an easy to access knife. Of course, you'll know where your knife is at all times, being that it's on the same chest rig as your pistol. And overall, I think it came out pretty awesome 
and pretty cool. So just thought I'd throw this video out there for kind of an idea and a workaround if you are running a similar chest rig for another handgun, because even though the Desert Eagle is a little bit large and ridiculous, a lot of people do run, you know, Glock 20s and other handguns, you know, revolvers and such in chest rigs, especially this very chest rig, the Kenai. And so you can, you know, throw a knife that you might use even for, say, say cleaning fish or you know processing fish you can throw that knife on your chest rig and to get a little bit more work or a little bit more versatility or use out of the same rig that you're already carrying so hopefully this kind of uh, gives you guys some ideas on things that you can do and uh, i'm overall pretty impressed and pretty happy with how this turned out especially with this particular knife like i said i like the mak a lot for many different types of wilderness tasks and purposes. So having it at ready access with the self-defense handgun, or wilderness self-defense handgun is a pretty nice setup. So anyways, guys, as always, God bless and I'm out.